it's your girl jersey styles um you guys voted on which style that you guys wanted me to do a tutorial on and it was the retro puff that i did so that is the first style i will be doing a tutorial on and then i'll work on the other ones later but um my hair basically has been in this old twist out for about a week and shrunken because i had sprayed water and all this other stuff so i'm going to show you guys how i did that style the first thing i do is I part out a section in the very front of my hair just like this and it doesn't have to be perfect because you're not going to see the part and it doesn't have to go real far back it just has to be a nice little section up in front okay so I'm gonna basically pull the rest of my hair back right now so it's not in the way and I'm going to spray just a little bit of water on this front part of my hair. Just like that. And I'm gonna grab, um, this is the Jane Carter Twist and Lock Cream. Um, it's really good if you're doing twists, locks, things like that. So I've been using that to basically moisturize and to do twists. So all I'm gonna do is grab sections and two strand twist it. So this is the first section. And that just two strand twist it going downwards. Okay, YouTube, I'm back. I finished two strand twisted. This front section of my hair, it's only about six or seven two strand twists. So I'm just gonna hold that out of the way right here. Okay, so the next step is to do the puff. So I do my puff, just I spray water just around the perimeter, the part that's supposed to be slicked down. like this keep more water so now I have water around the perimeter and my hair is a little shrunken so I'm just pulling it to stretch it a little bit before I do the actual puff so that's that um, I also like to grab some sort of moisturizing cream I'm just gonna use a twist and lock since I'm already using it to put around the perimeter so that the gel won't really damage my hair. So that's all I'm doing, putting cream around my edges. Then I grab my brush, it's a little one. Brush the hair so it's nice and slick. Just like this. And then I grab an old stocking. That's all it is. Old nylon stocking. And I put it around my head just like this. And I pull upward. into a nice puff and then it looks all big and full and I don't pull all the way tight because I don't want it to be like a ponytail but a puff so I do just like that and I wrap it around twice then I tie it like this and then I tie a nice little knot 
like that. And then I tuck the ends inward so that it doesn't flop out. So basically, here's my puff. It's big and pretty. So that's my puff. And that's basically it for the puff. Now, with these twists, what I do is I basically two strand twist all the twists at the very bottom like this. Just like this. Then I flip it backwards like this. I hope you can see it, but I flip it backwards so that the twists are full, just like that. So it's like a twisted hump. Then I grab my bobby pin and I just pin them backwards. And you can play around with it to get it positioned exactly how you want it and pin areas that you want to lay a certain way. But I just put bobby pins wherever I see it's necessary. So now you have your big pretty poof and you have your little pin up twisted hump in the front. Now the last piece is the accessory. And um, I have these wire headbands. It's just a long headband, but it has a wire on the inside of it. And the one I had in the other style was a different color, but I have several of these. And I bought them from um, the shop, this Etsy shop. I'll put the link to the Etsy shop that I bought it from below. So basically I grab it and I just put it around just like this and then the wires bend so I just twist the wires around just like this and then you can kind of fix the, the wires to lay a certain type of way so basically you have a super retro look and like just with one accessory you can turn like a really simple hairstyle into something really cute and different so this is definitely just cute and the last thing I do of course is my baby hair so grab my big old eco styler gel it's almost all done just grab a little bit of gel and I put it around my edges just like this. Slick it backwards. Just like this. And then I like to grab my toothbrush. Toothbrushes work the best. And I um, fixed up my baby hairs just like this in a nice little loop. You do this side. And then brush the edges up. So, here it is guys. This is the style that you all requested. It's a quick style. It literally, literally took me only 20 minutes to do this style. And it's so cute. And these accessories are awesome. I will be buying more of these. So tell me what you think. Please rate, comment, subscribe, and keep voting um, on the styles from the other video so I can decide which is the second style I'll do a tutorial on for you guys. All right, and make sure to follow me on Instagram because I update on my fitness challenge and on my hair almost daily on Instagram. It's the same as my YouTube name, Jersey Styles with two Zs. Um, 
And just to update you guys, I've actually lost about 10 pounds. I hope you guys can tell. My tummy is completely gone now, so I'm happy. But I want to lose about another 5 pounds, and then I'll be all done. So, bye guys. I'll see you guys later. Bye.